Wine Links Video uh, in partnership with Great Wine News. I'm Graham Bousfield, and we have as our guest today Anthony Mueller, who's on the road to uh, becoming, uh, or to achieving, I should say, a uh, Master uh, Sommelier uh, Diploma. Uh, welcome to uh, the program. It's good to be here. Thank you, Graham. Thank you, Anthony, for coming. We've heard a lot in terms of the uh, sommelier uh, program and how difficult it is mm. to achieve uh, the uh, rank of master sommelier. Perhaps you could explain to us a little bit of what's necessary in order to learn and achieve uh, that ranking. You brought along one of the tools of the <laughs> trade, or, or yes. one of the prior tools of yes. the trade. Maybe you'd like to talk yeah. a little bit about yes. what we have here. So, <laughs> so what we have here is uh, um, you know, something uh, of the past. They don't really give these out anymore. Uh, this is what is called a, a testivin. Uh, so what they used to do, the soulmate used to walk around the dining room uh, with his testivin around his neck. And when he approached the table, he would uh, you know, put down his glassware. Uh, he would present the wine. He would pour it. And before he would pour it into the glass. He would actually pour some into his little cup, this is the testament, and the sommelier, the sommelier's cup, the sommelier's key, and he would sip it, making sure the wine was sound and good for the guest. It would be rude to pour bad wine into the, the guest's cup. Uh, that be, would be very bad. However, uh, we've kind of moved away from that because what that does is kind of leaves you open for a few different things. Uh, now the sommelier's role is more of kind of wine steward. Uh, we're here to you know, assist the guest in choosing you know a, a good wine uh, for you know for their meal, or you know simply bring them what what they want. Mm. Um, if you put wine in your cup and you sip it and you taste it, and you say this is a good wine, here you go, and the guest says, oh, this is no good. Oh, send it back. <laughs> oh, it's no good. <clears throat> now you've kind of opened yourself up to uh, a little bit of animosity. Now you're saying, well, I'm a sommelier. I know this wine is good. You should drink this, sir. <laughs> it's so we we kind of get away from that. Um, so now we're um, very, um, you know, uh, industry friendly. We want to make sure that um, that the guest is happy. You know, it's it's a hospitality industry. We want to make sure that everyone's happy uh, with with their meal, with their choice of wine. And uh, so these have kind of gone away. Okay, so and leave it now to the fact that everybody has an individual palate, and then exactly. the guest uh, should be respected for what he believes exactly. is in the qualities exactly. of the wine. Exactly. All right. I'll thank you for uh, coming today and talking to us indeed about uh, the whole process of achieving a Master Sommelier uh, Diploma. Excellent. And uh, on behalf of uh, um, Video uh, Wine Links uh, and uh, Great Wine News, uh, the Graham Bousfield, and thanks for joining us today. Well, thank you so much.